Welcome to Rauta's review of black metal music. Today's album comes from Finland and it's one of the releases uh, that came out in October, so it's a pretty recent one. This band is called Aegrus, Aegrus, however it's pronounced, and the album called The Niminos Darkness. Now this one is uh, the second release by this band, at least when it comes to full-length album, and it is one of the most positive comers this year in the world of black metal. Let's take a look how this nice looking CD looks inside. So here we have this kind of an ominous sinister image on the foreground and uh, on the back there are skulls, up, uh, inverted crosses, uh, lit candles and all that stuff. Very traditional. Even the chalice part is something very typical in the black metal nowadays. This satanic stuff. So here we have pictures, lyrics, followed by more on the same pattern. So it's basically a image after image and then some lyrics. In the mid part we have the a picture of these lineup gentlemen here. So you can see how they look like. And there's more of the image versus lyric stuff going on. As you can see, it's pretty goddamn dark. And in here it's this way. Pretty goddamn dark and also uh, very typical in the way of how to portray satanic black metal band. And uh, here's the CD, yet more candles. Here is the the eye in a tri triangle. You get to see the Baphomet sigil and all that stuff. And on the background, just the track list. And it seems I'm tossing away this great CD. So what it comes when it comes to music of Agrus, the thing is that this is by no means an original when it comes to their style. This is more on the kind of typical second wave 1990s black metal in the Nordic way. The style is quite aggressive, it's fast tempo and it's melodic. Now a number of names might come to your head, but I put it here. It is the kind of Finnish version of Dark Funeral. It is not like these two bands are like siblings together, but there are a lot of similarities. Um, the Numinous Darkness barely manages to slow down. It's pretty much throughout its seven songs track list when it goes just almost all the way kind of up tempo. There's some slow parts and one actually not so good one on the fifth track, uh, The Black Stream of Death, where it kind of gets experimental in the midway of the uh, song. And that is like the only part which actually I felt like troubling because it felt unnecessary. It was something like, uh, hey, where this album is now suddenly going on? What the hell is going on here? But doesn't last that last long, and back then it's just back to the flock, keeping the same kind of uh, atmosphere going on. Now the uh, last track, Transcendence, there is a nice guitar solo which actually reminds me of a basic traditional heavy metal rather than black metal, and that is kind of a nice end touch of the whole album. Now riffs wise, this album isn't so plain dark funeral as you might think of. It's more of the Nordic style with, um, or like Finnish style maybe, more like Satanic Warmaster and maybe Behexen. So lots of Finnish traditional kind of spices or pieces, elements, whatever you want to call them, which are made into this, not maybe fantastic, but great uh, soup all in all. So this one is like well balanced, um, well thought of and well executed album. There are no clear mistakes except the very minor part in the track 5 and everything else just seems to go well. 
and um, I think the kind of a thin uh, production, you know, the guitar sounds and all that stuff, even though they might need a little bit of uh, getting used to before they actually start to, you know, find their place. After a while, I think they are very well fitting for the music what is presented here. So, what can I say? This one is one of the better black metal albums this year, and it's good continuation to this year when we have other great black metal releases already by uh, Finnish black metal scene, Clandestine Blaze, White Death, and uh, Rienaus, to just name a few. So, if Finnish black metal is your cup of tea, if you or if you're interested in just melodic fast pace black metal, check this one out. I guarantee it won't be your waste of time. This is a good one and should belong to your CD collection if you call yourself a black metal person in any way. So that's all from me. Thank you for watching and uh, please give your comments below why or why why not agree with me on this very album. That's all from me. Please subscribe if you haven't done it so far and uh, see you on the next review.